time for my roast, isn't it? Yes, it is. All right. You say worse things about yourself than we can. I know. I know. I love to smell Forget my own it. duty. <laughs> <laughs> I do. What are we going to say? Here? Love it. <laughs> love my stink. <laughs> I could You'll wallow in my stink. Find something, Jackie. <laughs> All right, so who's going first, Jackie? Jackie, Jackie first. you want to go first? I don't care. All right. All right go, go ahead and go up there and skewer well, me. Bro, it's so. time. Don't, is there oh, special bro. music? Oh, See, look. this was weird because Gary came to me and he said... This was his idea, right? Yeah, well, he said to me, you know, all the guys are goofing on the fact that you're separated. I go, really? yeah. I go, so he goes, we want to do a roast. I said, well, go ahead. I don't care, but... When was this goofing I, I never had on? a discussion with him. I never heard it. Can I tell you something? I don't want... I, don't, I, sh- I didn't want to be the guy who goes, no, you can't do that. Right. Because well, then it looks like I can't make right. fun of myself. But this was we not brought, something we all put together. No, we this brought it up no. in a meeting. We said, hey, wouldn't it be funny to roast you? And you you brought it up. You, kept, no, you brought, brought it up 20 up, times. I brought it up in the meeting once, and you said, that's I a good idea. Good okay. Well, yeah, because what am I going to say? In front of everybody? No, you're not okay. allowed to do that. This is He's all my idea. He's been dying for yeah. a roast. Uh, yeah. Stop <laughs> it. Why don't you just say it? It's not that big a deal to me. And I've where was all this goofing going on? I would not go. He keeps bringing it up every minute. Are you telling me he said that the guys around the office were goofing? He goes, yeah, you know, I think Gary had a bunch of material or something. No, I didn't have any material. All right, in let's fact, see. Let me hear the roast. In fact, two months yeah, went right. by. I didn't even book the roast. Okay, whatever. And then it came up in a meeting. What, what happened to the roast? Aren't we doing that? I didn't say that. That's, now uh, he's trying to cut worm out of it. Right. <laughs> he, he's the one who started all this roast. I, did, I yeah, didn't. I brought it up as I'm an idea. I'm not looking for a roast. We all have ideas is, on the show. Is that the only time Shut you up, brought Robin. it up? Get an idea. Let's bring it to the meeting, and then you can talk. I do. He I brought go it up to me. I come to you with ideas all the time that you introduce in the meeting. You're an idea person. It certainly wasn't a roast, though. All right. Can I hear the roast now? Jackie, you want to go first? Yeah. Go ahead. Make fun of a really tragic situation. Yeah, go to the podium. Let's see. (laughs) You have to wear headphones? Yeah, there's headphones there. You can wear headphones. He's, he's, he's acting as if he never wanted this to happen. Madonna. He even suggested it for the birthday show. Uh, yeah, and Howard thought it was a great idea. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let me hear it. Come on, let's go. Let's see what you got, joke man. Okay, pal. <laughs> he's getting laughs already. <laughs> okay. Right, you want me to be quiet during it? I don't care. All right, go ahead. Anyway, so. All right, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> was it raining? It seems the magic is back in your marriage. Your house disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's funny. Yeah. I said, Harrison, Harrison. <clears throat> I said, Howard, why are you and Allison splitting up? And Howard said, Well, would you want to spend the rest of your life with somebody who's bad in bed, whose body is a mess, and never well, stops? Well, I don't want your bad mouth of my wife. Bad mouth well, me. Hey, finishing the joke. the joke. Oh, all right, go ahead. Oh, all right, go ahead. All right, go ahead. I, I know where he's going. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Sorry. It's touchy, it's man, okay? Walk. It's touchy. Just, just this was Baba Boo's idea. You know, yeah. I didn't want to do this. Start, Start over. Why don't I do it like three times? All right, go ahead. Because okay. <laughs> I'm going to miss the joke now. You're going to miss the joke anyway. I like how it's my fault that the joke's not going over. Go ahead. <laughs> You asked Howard and Allison, what? Would you guys wake me up? (laughs) (laughs) Maybe someone else should go. Come on, Jack, go go for it. I said, Howard, why are you and Allison splitting up? He said, would you want to spend the rest of your life with somebody who's bad in bed, whose body is a mess, and who never stops whining and complaining? I said, no. He said, neither would she. (laughs) All right. (laughs) Relax. I love your wife. Good. It was my fault. (laughs) <laughs> Howard wanted to break up because he was sick of living in a two-story house. The two stories were, I have a headache and I'm too tired. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Married sex can get dull, but Howard got to the point where he didn't know if he was using his penis or a tranquilizer dart. <laughs> <laughs> and we understand that, on the whole, you needed a change. Oh. Oh. All right, are you done? No. Nope. Please. I asked Please the finish. singing psychic if we'd ever see them together again, and she said, at Richard Simmons' wedding. <laughs> <laughs> at least there's no dust on your balls. What? What? Angie Everhart, just think, in the 70s you were going to Sly Stallone's movies, and now you're swimming in the same pool, allegedly. What? <laughs> That's absurd. These aren't jokes. These aren't jokes. These are just the angry ramblings of a madman. Angie's, right? a, Angie's a big girl. I bet you have to bang it against one side to make the other side jealous. Oh. What? Why are you, you attacking Angie? Angie? Why well, she didn't do a thing? You? Oh, joke, man. Yeah, I want you to have the hook. Because, seriously, Wait a minute. You, Does he have a finishing yes, uh, I do. go to the I don't bottom. understand why I you're have... attacking people. That mm. You should be attacking me. Right. Mm. You mean kind of like when you attack my wife instead of me? Right. Well, no, I'm not well, he married anymore. He doesn't have anymore. a wife anymore, yeah. so don't attack anybody but him. 
to attack me. What are we supposed to say? I don't know. I'll you're tell you when I get up what you're supposed to say. Let Gary go. All right, you're done. Let Gary go. You're done. You're done. You're done. What is he doing now? I don't know. Enough. He's holding an envelope up to his head. Half and half. Enough. Half and half. 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 What did Allison get, and how much of a fag is your new wife, Ralph? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Come on. Sit down. Uh, you know, I got to tell you, Jackie doesn't disappoint. No, he doesn't. He bombs every time. <laughs> it may not have been funny, but he doesn't disappoint. No. All right. Sit down. Oh, Sit down. It's smart for you to go first. <laughs> You know what it is? He always changes his delivery. That's not yeah. how he usually delivers no. jokes. He, he tried something new. He was low-key yeah. this time. I saw what was going on. What was going on? <laughs> Thank you, Jackie. <laughs> you told the audience not to laugh. <laughs> you made it. Oh. That was so funny. You hey. set me up. Tell me, Henny, did, did he tell him to, to laugh? You guys told me you were going to roast me. I, and that's what I'm going to do. All I right. No, I didn't, Thank you. I didn't preview his right. jokes. Okay, I, good. But, you know what? Are you, you ready? What? Yeah. I didn't preview. I, I thought we knew. You didn't preview my joke? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry for me to even insinuate. You should have. Thank you. <laughs> Go ahead. Let's see. Let me see what you have in mind. All right, Howard. You know, the, Bob, the, Bob, the, the, the breakup is very sad. Right. Losing a wife can be hard. Right. Teeth is sad. In, in uh, your case, it was almost impossible. <laughs> what? <laughs> what did he say? I said losing a wife can be hard. Right. In your case, it was almost impossible. <laughs> I don't get it. You lost a wife. You tried to lose. Okay. I know you and Allison couldn't agree on everything. Did you, you shouldn't really. Your jokes, you, you really shouldn't question her judgment. I mean, after all, look who she married. Right. Now I know the separation has been tough on the kids. <laughs> I heard you bought your daughter a divorce Barbie. It comes with all of Ken's assets. <laughs> you know, marriage is a lot like a hurricane, Howard. In the beginning, there's a lot of sucking and blowing, and in the end, your house is gone. All right. I don't want to do this anymore. Uh, no, really, Howard and Allison, you guys had an amicable split. You split the house 50-50. Allison got the inside, and Howard got the outside. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that wasn't bad. But it's great. Howard, you know, now you have a big uh, New York City apartment. Right. I heard you finished it by call, uh, furnished it by calling Dial-A-Mattress. You dialed M-A-T-T-R-E-S. You left the last S off for She Got All My Stuff. <laughs> <laughs> want to hear some more dick jokes? <laughs> Howard really thought it was going to work out. He knew he married Miss Wright. He just didn't know her first name was always. All right, come on. I, you know, if I want to read the Henny Young with joke book, I can uh, before Howard, do it on my own. Before marriage, Howard yearned for Allison. After he married her, the Y became silent. Earned for Allison. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You know what's funnier? What? Listening to you guys cackle after these things die. At the wrong time. <laughs> but it's okay. Allison said it was okay to leave her as long as you left her enough. All right. All right. Listen. I, I this didn't, is, this I is didn't going, tell you Jackie's joke. This is going horribly my wrong. Is so much worse than yours, Jackie. <laughs> yes. Um, all right. I'll just say, uh, remember, Howard, you know why divorce is so expensive? Why? Because it's worth it. Oh, right. Great. Yeah. Terrific. Uh, who's right. next? You got any other ideas for bits, Gary? <laughs> oh, Casey? Oh, come on. This guy's not funny. He's going to be good. This is <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is brutal. All right, Howard. Why do you let Fred go? You're a ladies' man. <laughs> All right, Fred, you want to go before me? No, go ahead. You're up there. Go All right, ahead. Howard, go listen. Ahead, you're, you're a real important man, so I'm not going to take up much of your time. I know you have a busy day sticking that beak of yours in the dirt looking for ants to eat. <laughs> that's, funny. that's funny. That's the best line. I that's love the how funny. He his <laughs> but he's he at least is funny. He's uh, got time. Listen to me, listen to me. Howard, you're the most dedicated man I know. It took you twenty years to build your career and twenty five to wreck your marriage. Good job, douchebag. <laughs> All right. Thank you. You see that? <laughs> okay. You, Not funny. <laughs> yeah, but at least it's oh, that's funny. Okay. At least it's on target. <laughs> he couldn't satisfy his wife with two therapists and a vibrator. All right. I heard that Howard and Allison actually slept in separate rooms. Oh, come on. This is absurd. No, no, no. Apparently, Howard's ego took up the whole bed. <laughs> oh, okay. When he had to move out of his house, he had to leave behind the most important thing in his life. The only thing that mattered. The one thing that was always there for him. It's so sad that his full-length mirror wouldn't fit in the U-Haul. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I heard all those times... No, I, I won't do that one. But no, seriously. Right. I feel really horrible for you, boss. The only person I feel worse for is your television director, Scott Dupace. 
This guy has to buy two bus tickets and a subway token just to find your good side. <laughs> wow. Okay. That's good. Howard gives new meaning to the word feeble. He once lost an, a wrestling match to the drummer from Def Leppard. <laughs> all right. Good. He took martial arts for eight years and can barely break wind. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, all right, you know what? At least he's attacking you. <laughs> yeah, attack yeah, me. Yeah, you're, you're lucky. You're lucky if you can l even lift your, your ass off of Ralph's lips. <laughs> <laughs> your legs are so weak. When you go to the gym and wear spandex, you gotta wear a belt. <laughs> I think I think go. Who's up next? If anybody, Fred. Fred, Fred, you wanna go? Fred, I wanna go. No, don't go. It's this, enough. This is, this is stupid. <laughs> I had a bleep boy ye off, not because of. Uh, I, he, he was so funny. He was hysterical. But. <laughs> Come on, Fred. I, I don't want to. It's a, this is so dumb. Fred, you can't help this situation. <laughs> this is really. Dumb. Do you want to go, Benji? Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, I'll definitely. go. All right, let's. You want to go? Why don't you? You want to go, Fred? I'll give you. I'll give you my opening thing. All right, go ahead. And my closing. All right, go ahead. Because I'm so bored by the rest of this. All right, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind if you roast me. No, I know that. All right. But, uh, Fred, are you going to get up to the podium? Yeah, come no, on, I have Fred, to run my own like... sound effects. All right, go ahead. Oh, here's sound effects. Uh, I have sound effects. Hmm. Jackie, Gary, Robin, dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> what can be said about our big-beaked, long-nosed, huge-nostrilled friend that hasn't been said already? <laughs> <laughs> When Howard was born, January 12th, 1954, a terrible thing happened. He lived. <laughs> <laughs> Howard was an ugly baby. When he was born, the doctors wanted to add a tail. <laughs> but seriously, I've known Howard for 21 years, and success really hasn't changed him. He's still the same miserable prick that he was 21 years ago. <laughs> Only now... His wife would finally agree with me. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, we can't forget Howard's wife. Too bad he did. <laughs> but Howard did have a plan for his marriage. It's called neglect. <laughs> <laughs> Howard never told his wife that he wasn't good enough for her. He just let her let it come as a surprise. <laughs> now, this is a roast. That's finally, a roast, and it's directed to me. Yes. Look on the bright side. Yes. Be glad that your wife kicked you out for being the world's worst husband. Because if you'd stayed in a bad marriage, you would have ended up like Jackie Martling. <laughs> <laughs> now there's, there's a schmuck. <laughs> Imagine being married to his prize. Having <laughs> to build her a recording studio. Financing one of her stupid plays. Paying for the artwork on her stupid new oh, CD. How did I know you going to start roasting Howard and wind the up roasting player me, on the Fred. side. <laughs> Shut up, stupid. If you, wanna see, if you want to see what your future could have been, been, look over to your left and stare at every wrinkly line in that old drunk's face <laughs> and be thankful that Allison kicked you out. She is a saint. <laughs> Thank you, You are Fred. a Martian. <laughs> Thank you. No, that's a wrong. No, no. You see, that's funny, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> now go sell your tchotchkes. Wow. Thank you, Fred, for saving this room. Wow. How'd I become a roast on Jackie? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. It was all right funny. That's good. That was a good roast. It's got to go somewhere. I'm with you. Jeez, what were these other guys doing? Just reading Milton Berle books. <laughs> <laughs> Does anybody want to follow that? Benji, you can go. Yeah, I don't go. have to go. I'll go. It's, if it's so let me hear Stuttering John. Okay. <laughs> I hope you get the concept. I do. Do you? Yeah. Maybe John you. will know how to read. John, <laughs> the preview Benji's. Is <laughs> Benji's a loose cannon, too? Yeah. Who's Stuttering John? <laughs> All serious. <laughs> There are many reasons why Allison left this chew bag. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who is he? Who is he? Shoot him now. <laughs> the main reason Allison left him is because she couldn't stomach that surfboard. He, he calls a nose. <laughs> ah, you are so bad. <laughs> when he came out of his mother, <laughs> a, a private was shaped like a keyhole. What? <laughs> 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 oh, his, initials, his initials, Howard Allen Stern, H A S, stands for has, as in has a big schnozzola. <laughs> which is another word for nose. <laughs> Why are you talking so far? Why are you talking so strange? I think this is a delivery oh. thing he worked with. Yes. Come on, don't, don't cut me off here. <laughs> when you look at that nose. <laughs> 
<laughs> and you say God bless you even before he sneezes. <laughs> Kids, when it rains, kids would take shelter under that nose. <laughs> <laughs> the only person I know who uses a necklace for a nose ring. <laughs> <laughs> I like this delivery. <laughs> for Halloween, kids used to paint the face on that nose <laughs> and call it his Siamese twin. When, <laughs> when Howard got a nose job, <laughs> they, built a, they built another person with the remains of that nose. Oh. Anyway, just remember, Howard, you'll always be stuck with that humongous, snot-filled, disgusting nose. <laughs> Thank you, John. Thank you. Wow. Oh, that wasn't a bad job. Come on. Give him some credit. Yeah, but you know what? I just I have to say what it was very funny, but he, it had nothing to do with the separation. That was well, he worked at the nose, 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 matter. nose, nose. He was attacking Howard. I, I, I thought that was good. I didn't attack your wife. No, no yeah, I, I mean, I'm attack good. me. I, I think care. I have to say that I probably suffered by following Jackie. Yeah, yeah. I think you did. I don't think I had anything to do with it. You suffered by saying anything. <laughs> It's hard to rebound off of Jackie. Yeah, it's tough, man. You got to do Benji. You can't get the crowd back yeah. after somebody loses it like that. Yeah, oh. Can Jackie Benji go? Yeah, Benji's okay. Benji's all right, Benji's good. all right. I mean, Benji gets it. It's yeah, no. face dead. <laughs> all right, here's Benji. Recently thin from Nutrisystem. Thank you. Oh, thinner. Thinner. Uh, Howard, I just want to say uh, it's an honor to be given this opportunity to make fun of your pain. Okay. <laughs> We're celebrating an important man, Howard Stern, a man who used to have a key to Allison's heart, but now is no longer allowed to have a key to his house. I don't want to say Howard has a small penis, but it did take Allison two months into the separation to realize that they were no longer having sex. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to give you the Howard Stern sexual timeline. From birth to age 12, Howard didn't care about getting laid. From age 12 to 17, he couldn't get laid. From 17 to 20, he got laid a couple of times. From 21 to 46, Howard was married, so he probably didn't get laid. <laughs> From age 46 to 75, Howard, single, could get laid as much as he wants, but too emotionally distraught to act on it. From age 75 onward, he'll be emotionally ready to get laid, but his penis will no longer work. <laughs> <laughs> Could we have the cliff notes? <laughs> yeah. That was a lot of work. Yeah, he should have come with a chart and a wow. graph. Are right, you almost done? Yeah. Biology class. Allison is a beautiful woman, and Howard and Allison have three beautiful, intelligent daughters. You know, with the right stepdad, they could be the family of the year. <laughs> oh, that's, oh that, that's a good one. That was a good one. Thank you. <laughs> Certain numbers seem to reoccur in people's lives. In Howard, I think that number is one half. Half a penis, half a Jew, half a marriage, half his money gone, and at age 46, half his life is over. <laughs> <laughs> After 25 years of marriage, Howard has finally learned the secret to giving Allison an orgasm. Leave her. <laughs> yeah, that's good. All right, leave me alone. Uh, wait, wait, Are like you, I, do you have a finish? Come on, yeah. finish already. Yes, people yes, people yes. want you off. I yes. can sense it. I'd like to end by quoting the good book, Howard Stern's autobiography, Private Parts. Thank you. The secret of life is so simple. <laughs> <laughs> if you have kids, you live with the kids. Right. You don't move out on your wife. You stay with her even if you banged her 9,000 times and you're sick of it. <laughs> Nobody follows that. That's the secret to life. <laughs> That's funny. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you, Benji. Good job. Funny. Can you read my band joke? It's, it's really good. Get up. You did well. You did well. Give up. <laughs> my band joke is the best one Even I John was good. <laughs> John was excellent. Right. Thank God no, for the no, amateurs no, no. here. <laughs> Let me tell you. So who's your favorite, Howard? <laughs> well, listen, it was all good. Who was your least favorite? <laughs> <laughs> Three guesses. <laughs> I didn't see that. Look, Jackie doesn't do well at roast. We know that. It's high pressure situations. I right. Very tough. You know, it's hard for him to be funny in that situation. <laughs> when you have to tell jokes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>
I love the way Fred was not animated until he got to me. <laughs> right. Yeah, he must have he some real hate for you. Yeah, there's, there's a weird yeah. thing going on there. Perfect yeah, delivery. just analyze, guys. It's a roast, stupid. It was yeah. perfect. No, but I thought it was very funny. It's it was just excellent. jokes. It was just what a roast I could take, I could take a joke. It was I could very take funny. A joke. I thought it was yeah. funny. I, I thought John's stuff about my nose being the size of a surfboard. That was great. My mother's vagina, everything. We were told to do a roast about your separation. Yeah, thank you. You did great. We were told. Now he's getting instructed. You were the one who decided. I think you did fine. <laughs> you know, Jackie was the only one who kind of sucked. Doesn't get it. Well, Gary had a little trouble too. Yeah, did Gary well, no, my jokes weren't funny. Jackie's were just plain old angry. <laughs> yeah. right. The only right. difference. Yeah. Howard, Jackie's Howard. weren't jokes. Well, Gary had a whole book to choose uh, from. Dirty. Those were the jokes. <laughs> right. Well, no, no. There's only John, how did you do it? Did you come up with your own material? Yeah, yeah. I just, I just had all them. your own. You just sat there. Yeah. Right. Oh, that's good. Well, they love that oh, nose stuff. The nose thing was great. It was funny. That was very funny. Benji too. Benji, Casey, very Benji good. was excellent. Casey, Freddy. you know, he was a little waff. He waffled a little bit. Well, there it is. The that's roast. A, that's a hit, huh? <laughs> yeah, I liked it. <laughs> it, it, it was, thank fun, goodness, man. it was pulled it out over. at the end. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, Steve, go ahead. Yeah, Howard. Uh, you know, not for nothing, but I waited a week for this. <laughs> <laughs> I really thought that Jackie would have came up with better material than that. I mean, he. Sucks so bad. Sorry, I, man. I would rather listen to his wife's album tied down <laughs> and, and the Jesus twins at the same time that they oh. had to go through what, what Jackie put us through for that that amount of time. Right. Fred, Fred is a genius. Right. Fred, Fred, Fred gets definitely gets a thumbs up. But Thanks. I mean, what I think you guys should do is roast Jackie. <laughs> Uh, really yeah, roast him. Put him we roast him all the time. Every day. No, yeah, but how, how much do you need? You, you brought up a funny point. Jackie did a different delivery today. Almost like, it was like a weird delivery, because I've seen him as live act, and it's right. like more animated, right. but it was almost like, that yeah, wasn't well, Jackie. I'll do these jokes if necessary. Right. You know what I mean? Well, yeah, delivery. he didn't want to seem like he was trying. He wasn't confident in the material. No. It was an angry, drunk Shut rope. Up. <laughs> Jackie, why the difference? Why the change? The, the gentleman's I'm just, correct. I was just reading my joke. But why the change in the why? delivery? Why not the like traditional I, Jackie delivery? Uh, wait, we didn't even get, you know, you didn't even do your usual smile. No laughs between jokes. Kind of thing. No, come right. on, that's funny. Yeah. Right. No, you people are jerks. <laughs> come on, you'll laugh at that going home. Because driving. I the was going to get stopped. You had a different just, voice. Right. Everything. Right. So why, when did you decide to change the uh, delivery? I just, I just did, did it the way I felt like doing it. I mean, you attack the guy's wife. I mean, she has nothing to do with what's going on, and uh, which but is kind of what happens to me on a daily basis. <sighs> but you know, there wasn't even any. It, it was just mean spirited. Nothing. It was not. It was. Shut up. Yes, it Put was. Put something in your cake hole. Yes, <laughs> it was. It was mean spirited. You're out of your mind. Uh, and, you're you're as, and, and you're as rough as you are daily. And you're not. All right, thanks, Howard. All right, thank you, Steve. Right, I was bye -bye. mean spirited, and Fred was jolly. <laughs> yes, he was. Uh, you Except when deaf he got to bitch. you, then you he mock. became you mean deaf, spirited. You deaf, dopey bitch. <laughs> Maybe oh, come on, <laughs> that's that's uncalled for. That is, and that no, is mean spirited. Him. Let him, because that's the same delivery he used for you. Right. Oh. <laughs> I think he even called me a deaf, dopey bitch. <laughs> oh, All right. Well, anyway, listen. Thank you for the roast. I'm very honored Howard, that you Howard, would. Uh, right as we speak, a thousand tickets have been returned for Jackie's next gig. <laughs> <laughs> You're assuming right. that he could book a place that has a thousand people in it. <laughs> All right. Anyway. That would be Detroit. Is, is someone working the phones? Yeah, I think someone so. Must be. Was, uh, Why? Everybody's in here. Everybody's in. <laughs> Who is working? Gange. Gange. Yeah. He's doing a good job. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyway. Um, the Howard Stern Rose. The Howard Stern Rose. We should do this again real soon. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> like in the year 2025 like 25. Save that no, sign. Come in on, the boss, year was fun, 25. Man. It was fun. It was it fun. Was I, fun. It was fun. For a minute. Can I release my band joke on some sort of like pay per view? Thing? Yes, absolutely. When okay. it wasn't painful, it was fun. All right. Thank you and uh, good night. <laughs>